Hi, welcome back to another YouTube video. So in this video, I'm going to talk about branded search campaigns and should you run them for your business. So what is a branded search campaign? Well, essentially, it is a campaign on Google where you've got your keywords inside your ad group that relate specifically to your brand names. So for us, we're called UKB Marketing. We would have an ad group where we have UKB Marketing as our keyword. We're going to put an exact match on that. So basically, whenever someone types in UKB Marketing, we are going to show up. Again, we can use an exact match. We can use phrase match. I would not use broad match because we don't want people who are just typing in marketing for our stuff to come up instead we would want like it to be something that relates to ukb marketing specifically okay so exact match is going to be the real one that we want to go with there what this does is it means that when someone types in our brand we show right at the top as an advert now let's say we also rank directly underneath that as our organic seo result well that is good but if we're a very well-known company other people might start bidding on our keywords so let's say we're yeah you know, let's say we're one of the biggest agencies in the world we're not but let's say we are hopefully one day what will happen is other companies will start bidding on UKB Marketing's keywords. So when someone types in UKB Marketing, we would be underneath as just our organic results, but their advert would show up at the top and they might say, best marketing agency in the world, results driven, you know, award winning. And you click on their advert because they've got a good ad copy at the top. You click on it and you end up losing the customer to that specific competitor. So you'll see this all the time if you type in like ClickFunnels, which is a, a marketing platform. If you type in any sort of business, you'll see their competitors are ranking right at the top. Sometimes they even use their competitors' names in the advert, which is a bit cheeky. How dare you? What I would say is, yes, it is worth running a branded search campaign if you are in that position. However, if you're not in that position where no one else is bidding on your keywords, there's just no point because you're just wasting money. So when someone types in your brand name, if you're the only result that comes up in terms of being relevant and there's no one bidding at the top for your your keywords and showing an ad and again you can see some of the stuff just by actually typing it and you'll see if there's ads that pop up from time to time I and mean, you can use tracking tools as well to see if, if other people are doing that to some extent but let's say that uh, no one else is bidding on your keywords there's no real point in doing that yourself because you would get that click anyway when someone types in your brand name they would click on your result your organic SEO result and you would go at the top and they would go and transact with you however like I say if you are a business where there's other people bidding on your keywords I would create a branded search campaign because yours will be the most relevant because it is for your business therefore yours can show at the very very top they'll click on it and you will get the sale that you would have already gotten so it's a bit of an insurance policy now you can spend a lot less you know we can spend very very low numbers you know 10 pounds 20 pounds 50 pounds a day on branded search that can work extremely well in comparison to spending upwards of thousands of pounds per day on cold audience campaigns okay so you can spend a comparatively lower amount and it's a good insurance policy depending on how much sort of search volume and traffic there is related to that keyword um, you can spend a lot less and again it's going to work very very well now one thing to keep in mind is that the efficiency of that advert is going to be very high so we always break it out into its own campaign we have a branded search campaign we don't just have a branded search ad group because let's say we've got our main campaign and then we have an ad group for branded search the problem is that that ads group is going to be extremely efficient it's going to work very very well because people are looking for your brand they find your brand and then they're going to go and buy your product okay so that advert or that ad group is going to work very very well and if you're then looking at your campaign results and you have your cold audience campaigns and your keywords that are not related to your specific brand search and then you've got your branded search in there the overall result is going to be flavored by that branded search ad group so instead what we do is we break out into its own campaign so that we can clearly see well look maybe this one's got a 20 times ROAS or a 50 times ROAS or something incredible like that however However, we know, okay, we can take that into consideration and we can understand that that's because people are literally typing in our brand name. And instead, we're going to focus on other cold keyword audience campaigns where we can then start saying, okay, how can we improve the efficiency of those? Because there are real money makers that we can spend more money through. So you just need to be aware it's going to be a lot more efficient and it can kind of distort the results. And I've seen this before in accounts we've audited, but we've gone in and they say, look, we're getting like a 10 times ROAS. And I break it down. And I'm like, well, your branded search campaign is getting like a 15 or 20 times ROAS and then your other audience, your other keywords are not really getting anything at all. And instead, they're just pulling that average down, but they're not bringing anything to the mix. So it's really important that you take that into consideration because a lot of those sales will have happened anyway. So you know, when you've got, when you're getting like a 20, 30 times, 40 times ROAS on that branded search campaign, a lot of times those sales would have happened regardless because they will have clicked through to your specific organic search result. So it's more of an insurance policy. It's less of a, yay, we're winning, we're doing incredible because we're getting a 20 times ROAS on our own keywords. Okay, so just keep that in mind, but it can be a valuable asset and it can work very well in your Google campaign media mix. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like, subscribe, click the bell icon, comment if you have any questions, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.